two very fine people from Florida came over to visit, Patrick and Karen Moore. So I took them up to my favorite restaurant, and you'll see in a minute why. It's in Omerima. That's south of the Matt Cook area at Lady Bird Hill. It's a winery and restaurant. One of the finest I've seen in the country for what it does. There's never seen anything like it. What a beautiful spot to hang out to. You can climb that mountain, you wander through the wood vineyards, or you can just relax with the wine. But here's the important part. This lake is full, and I mean full, of salmon. Over 500, he says. And they're all hungry. So guess who is going to catch one? We just don't know, do we? I think Karen is the expert here, and she's going to give it a whirl shortly. Not real clear, can't see him too good today, but that's okay. Here come the guys with the equipment. You see Patrick's helping. Oh, there's the bus. As soon as Karen gets her hands on that uh, one of those rods there, I think all oh, is going to happen. Let's we'll see what the expert is going to do today. Doesn't take long, folks. That's the beauty of it. They're all hungry. <laughs> Let's see if one of them decides to go with Karen's lure. It's a bunch of them. Can't hardly see them in this photograph, but uh, you can see them good for where we're standing here. Amazing place. Just lovely. Roger and family have done a beautiful job here. Roger Smale is his name. He's gone out of his way to make sure everybody's happy with this one. I think that might do the job there, Karen. Let's see what happens. Excite those salmon. I'm hungry. Oh, there you go. That's the way to do it. Ooh, nice one. Look at that. All right. Good catch. I bet that'll provide us something to eat. I just let this thing run. I didn't cut any of it when I shot it. I uh, thought it was just too good to, to cut. Just let it all go and watch Karen be the great fisherman today. She knows how to handle fish, actually. She's done this before, I think. He's giving her a tessel, though. Come on, Karen. You've got him. Don't lose this one. Here comes the guy with the net. He thinks he's, he's about ready. Bring him on in. He didn't want to come in, does he? Don't think he's got much of a chance with the union of that rod. Here we go. Yay! It looks like lunch. All right, let's see what we have. Nice salmon. Yeah. Now we're talking. Anybody can come here and catch these. They're only charged $32 per salmon, and that's less than if you'd go out and get a license. And then, the surprising part is, look at this beautiful grounds. You can bring the family here and spend the day, I tell you. A lot of, a lot of families do, actually, a lot of people. You can take that salmon home with you, or, if you want, they will actually take it in and fix it for you. That's up on a, there's Roger killing it now. Getting it ready while we uh, go out and have a wine and he's gonna smoke it. So within about 30, 40 minutes, it'll be sitting at the table. We can eat inside, you can just look at this inside of this thing, isn't that beautiful? They didn't spare a thing on this place. Beautiful job. There's their wine cellar. You can come here and uh, enjoy some of their wines. 
Look at that. Ah, oh, great staff too. Fantastic. We decided to eat outside because it's just too nice to go inside today. Out by the trout pool. Yes, that's the trout pool. We don't catch those. These are just to look at. Great big trout. They beautiful. New Zealand's known for its trout, and this really shows them off well. Fantastic here at Ladybird Hill. Patrick wants to go in and grab one, I think. So here it is. That's the salmon that was caught, and it's going to be lunch. 